Hey everybody, I got a, a, a bay window cushion that I just finished. I've, so, I've, I've actually showed you guys how to uh, sew before, but I want to show people out there how to fill a, a bay cushion, a huge cushion like this. It's kind of, it's, it's kind of like a wrestling match. So let's, let's get started. First, we're going to take the old cover off, find the zipper slide. And uh, we, we didn't charge uh, new foam and Daycron on this because the customer didn't need new foam and Daycron. So I, I don't try to, uh, you know, sell people foam if they don't need it, especially since it's a polyurethane-based product and it's not going to break down and the landfills very fast. So we try to recycle as much as we can. So this is the old cover. I'm going to save it just in case the customer wants it. Here's the new cover. So we're going to get it all set up here. I'm going to fold it in half, and I'm going to try to get it inside the cushion at the halfway point. Then I'm going to try to push one side down, push the other side down, I'm going to quickly turn it over and try to get that to fill up the corners without ruining the zipper slide. As I told you, it's like a wrestling match. My son's laughing, but it's true. And then I'm going to push the middle down, try to unfold this inside the casing. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my hand and I'm going to pull to the corner, front, the front corner first, and I'm, I'm up at the top here. I'm going to go to the other side, front corner, top, and I'm going to push that. I'm concentrating on my front first. I'm going to flip it. I'm going to push the front. I'm feeling the corner from this side looks good. Then I'm going to work this corner here. Look, I'm pushing that. That looks good. I'm going to come to the other side. I'm going to flip it. Make sure that looks good. Okay, wow, it's really looking good. Now I'm going to take my salvage and I'm going to pull it down. Watch this. See how the salvage is up on top? You want it on the border side. You want to go all the way around like that. Go flip it to the other side. And now sometimes I take a little extra Daycron in the corners, but I really don't think I need to do it. it depends on the fabric. Some fabrics you need to do that. This fabric's really fitting like a glove. Okay, now I'm going to close it up. And I zip the slide. I'm a right-handed person, so I like to take the zipper from the right to the left, especially a big zipper like this. So I'm going to make sure my salvage is still running down, even on the back side. And I'll work that in there. That I don't like, so I'm going to try to get a little day in there. So you take a little bit of a, like a palm-sized piece of day cron, and then you just work it in so, like so. See that? And I'm making sure my salvage is down. Closing the zipper. And I think we need a little bit over in here, a little day for that. And then we're gonna finish it. Let's turn it around, take a look at it. Nice front edge. We're gonna line it up to the front. Look at that. That's a beautiful cushion. It really is. I'm just taking it. It's a little this way, so you can adjust it a little bit by going like so. And then when we get it to the house, we'll do the same thing. I'll bring my regulator, and we'll regulate it out. You've seen me use a regulator before, but there you have it. And there it is. <laughs>